Hey everybody, Nimble Rabbit here, and so some of you might have noticed, some of you might not, but I just hit 50 subscribers the other day, and I know I'm not uploading anywhere near as much as what I could and what I should be, but I thought I'd bring you some live duels today because I'm not sure if I've done it before, I might have done it once or twice, I know I've done it with uh, Relics the Noob a few times, so I'm going to come at you with three duels today. And if I could do a giveaway, I would, but I'm broke, so, uh, sorry about that. And also, I doubt there's, like, many cards I really have that you guys really want. Well, to be honest, I want to keep them. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, yeah, Free Axis Fire Kings sounds like a good way to start off. So, I, I know that most of you guys probably haven't seen me actually duel with these yet. I don't think anyone has, but... Uh, Here's your chance, so... Um, da, 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 da. Right, paper, paper. Yes. Okay, so I'm going first. And I've opened up... Crap. <laughs> um, Alright, okay. Wow. I don't usually get hands as bad as this, but... Uh, yeah, how do I mute? Uh, I can't, okay. Can I mute spectators in any way? It's not exactly spectators, are they? Do you know I'm actually bothered? Uh, ah, Dragoonity or is it Dragon Roller? Yeah, Dragon Roller. Okay, that's fine. Who's he pitching? Okay, a blaster. And he's playing Sword of Ravine Light. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It's all good. Just set a few cards and pass. Wow, this really sucks. Um, right. Uh, I'll send. Wait out his Sword of Ravine Light. So yeah. Um, you know, I'm not gonna, you know, keep you waiting, so, uh, yeah, 50 subscribers, very happy about that, thanks a lot for all of my, to all of my subscribers, um, I really want to be able to hit 150 by the end of the year, so, I need all you, all of you guys to give me a hand with that, and, you know, get me that to that 50 subscribers, uh, 150 subscribers. I know it's quite a bit of a long shot, I need another 100, but it, I just reckon it would just be awesome, an awesome thing to do. So, yeah, if you guys could give me a hand with that, it would be good. So, yeah, just grab the leopard, go to horse prints, get a lovely plus three while I'm at it. Uh, yes, please. And I want to grab chicken and add the bear to my hand. Um. Should I set another card? No, I'll end. I'll end that. I don't. I mean, I don't mind my chicken going to the grave if I have torrential tribute. I'll forbidden lance my horse prince. My chicken go to, can go to the grave for all I care. I don't need it just yet. Well, actually, I don't really need it again, to be honest. Uh, ravine. Okay, ditching some more. I doubt he can go for a Draco sack or big eye. But, um, synchro possibly into a like, stardust. Uh, no, that's fine. Okay. Yep, you can do that bull and just add some cards to your hand. I don't care. <sighs> that's I think that's the thing that everyone hates about the dragon rulers, just the pluses. 
they just <laughs> it's just not fair. It really isn't fair. Um then again I did just pull off like a plus three combo myself. So uh, DDR, yep, okay. I guess I'm gonna have to trench troll it that. Please have nothing else. Okay, that's all good. Barong. Do you want? Yes. I want my Barong on the field and I can set a few cards. And end at that because that sword's revealing like is a pain in the ass. So, uh, he's got Redox and Blaster in the grave, hasn't he? Really? Another sword? Okay, whatever. Whatever. Wow. I didn't actually realise that um, Dragon Rolls actually played Swords of Ring Light, to be honest. Um, I could go into a Diamond Die Wolf and a. Yeah, okay. Sounds good, actually. Um. Diamond Dire Wolf. Kindling. Let's try and get as much pressure on the field as I can. Ooh. Nah, I want to get rid of it. So, uh,. Go into another horse prince. Get another plus. Summon the Let's get rid of Barong. Okay, that's fine. Please don't have a mirror force. Mirror force. D prison. He's probably gonna have a. I don't know. He might have a D prison. He might not. I've got a forbidden lance. So magic cylinder. Uh. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. I ain't taking any life point damage. I'm making you get a little damage right now. <laughs> Still taking the fourteen hundred. Yes. Okay, uh, really, who the hell plays, so what is this, it's like, burn dragon rulers, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's okay, I'm pretty happy with that, this field, I mean, I, I don't run any level six, uh, rank six XEs, but, uh, I've got the rekindling in my hand, so, if you guys to do anything stupid, I'll just bring it all back with rekindling. So, I ain't too scared. There's not much you can do against my three monsters. To be honest, you can't get rid of all of them in, all of them in once, unless he has a dark coal or some stupid like that. But uh, yeah, this is fine. Try and get rid of that ravine if he doesn't. Ah, okay, he's gonna set one. Hmm. I could probably win now actually, so I'm gonna do so. Please don't be something chainable like a threatening roll. Scapegoat. Okay, so uh, yeah, I'll just attack. And yeah, that's it. Alright, so uh, save this quickly, just in case anything messes up. Uh, and let's play a different deck now. Uh, Blue Eyes Hierarchs, because I don't think I've any done any live duels with them. So, Blue Eyes Hieratics. 
Yeah, I've got quite a few uh, different things going on here. Uh, I don't know which one of this is. I've got a 1, a 3 and a 4. I don't know where number 2 has gone. So, come on. Okay, I'm going to second. Which is fine, it's not bad. Mallet, so I can get Wattel back into the deck. Um, it's not a bad hand. I've got an instant Azurize. I need it. Um, okay, that's fine. Now the thing about using Magical Mallet is that it is, it does minus one you, but uh, oh, that's actually not a bad hand. Yeah, I can go off. Let's get rid of that. And that was a bit of a waste, actually. So uh, it's okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Grab what tail? Hmm. Okay, that's fine. I can just attack you directly. That's fine. I don't mind that. Just, just dig at him. Okay. So if he tries to destroy it of card effect, I have a lance, and if he tries to destroy it through battle, I have a forbidden lance. So, uh, yeah, I'm not too worried, I guess. I don't mind sitting on a on a tomb. <laughs> Not when I've been lance there anyway. What is it with people reading swords or being light? Why? Why why are people running this card? <laughs> I'm not saying it's a bad card, I'm just not I'm just saying <laughs> why? <laughs> uh I could actually grab a blue eyes and just sit on that for a minute. Uh, yeah, I'll just sit on an Azure eyes. I don't mind doing that. Just keep myself safe for another turn. I could bring what back what tail and do a few more things. Okay. Code A Ancient Ruins and Aliens, okay. Honestly I don't really know too much about aliens, but that's fine. Okay, that kinda sucks. Hmm. Okay. Honestly, I have no idea what the alien deck is all about. It's I've never really took an interest in playing it, so I'm just wondering how this will go. So we asked, um, what will you do? Ah, chain Kage, it's Kage. Okay, that's fine. Going to a rank four. What are you gonna play? Or are you not gonna play anything? Yeah, you are. Okay. King Gremlin, okay. It's fine by me. Oh, King of the Feral Limps here in the TCG. <laughs> um, Ammonite, okay. So by the looks things, he's going through his air. Uh... Yeah, I'm just gonna have to try and OTK in this turn, I guess. Well, I can't because of sort of being light. Damn. Wait, I might be able to actually. So, uh, yeah, okay, that's fine. Uh, 
I want to bring out soon. Get rid of swords. Then I want to get a Labradorite. Overlay. Oh, it doesn't even matter which. I'll just overlay these two for now. Uh, use this to go into. Hmm. Another rank six, preferably. So I'll go to Techno. Okay, bounce back, King of the Feral Limps. Oh, okay, and. Two Gaia charges should do the trick. Yep, okay, so that was uh, the next game. Okay, guys, so uh, Blue Eyes Hieratics versus Alien. Now, for the last duel, uh, I'm probably going to use Constellas because it's the deck I play in real life, so let's just turn this down. So yeah, Constellas sound like a good idea for me to play, seeing as I know the deck really well. Yeah, I've been testing with a lot of different decks. So if you, if there's any, actually, I'll quickly go over some of these decks for you. Uh, just like scroll down. So if you, ooh, no, I don't want to do that. Actually, I'll just show them. Okay. So uh, any of these you guys want to see uh, in? Any dual videos or want deck profiles of them? Uh, I've got a load of different decks. To be honest, like Insectors. I've Hieratic. I've been playing a lot with Hieratics. A lot of Blue Eyes stuff. Trying to find some nice builds. TG Stun. It's one deck I like playing a lot lately. Uh, trying out a rank five deck. Um, but yeah, I guess Constellus is what I'm going to play now. Why do I always do that? Um, Constella. Yes, that was an OT uh, Exodia deck, but uh, I have. Okay, Constella. I don't know if I changed this deck that much. Um, if I've changed it, then I'm probably gonna think, oh no, because uh. I think I've changed it in a way that I don't like, <laughs> so uh, that w might kind of suck. But uh, I guess, I guess I'll just have to put up with it. To be honest, can I stop this? Mute opponent, mute spectators. See if that does anything. Yeah. Okay. Good. Kind of gets annoying having all these messages pop up. Uh, uh oh, unmute the opponent. Because, so it's good to be able to speak to your opponent. <sighs> what is it, gear gear? Oh, gadgets, okay, that's fine. Machine the gadget, yep. Set a back row, set two back row. Really? Hmm. No, I I want my search. I want my search. Piss off. <laughs> Soon I can go into play these better. That's how I always look at it. So I'll set two back row. Set two mirror force. <laughs> 
Hey. Um, I don't care about Sheraton not being able to attack, to be honest. So he's going to probably add... Is that a mech lord? Mech, mech lord emperor wise or something like that. Oh no. Okay, machine a gear frame. Machine a fortress. He's going to ditch... I don't even know. What is it? Fortress, fortress, okay. Yep, yeah. okay. Oh, mirror force. I know I'll probably get the effect of Machine of Fortress now to destroy something. Okay, uh, okay, attack again. You know what? I don't care. I'm just gonna get rid of it. Uh, I, just <laughs> I don't care if I'm using it. I want my traps. I really don't. Because I know as soon as I've got Pleiades on the field, I've got the control. So I've got Sombre as well, so I'm not looking too bad at the moment, I guess. If he has a Vela and. you know. It's not going to be too bad, I guess. Please don't have the Veiler. Because I know a lot of players like... To... Okay, it's all good. Change that into defence. I don't like back row, so and also it means I can get in, get somber easier. So let's just attack for twenty five hundred. Just end it like that. So I've got Pleiades just in case he goes and plays uh, his fortress from the grave. It means I'll have to discard a card, so. Guess that kind of sucks. Okay, that's fine. Some gadget. <laughs> it's not chained Kage to Kage, so I'm guessing the only thing he's really gonna do is summon the fortune. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Uh. <sighs> I'll wait until the battle phase. Going to crash, yeah, I thought so. No, you ain't crashing. I've just got to hope he hits the dark hole, to be honest. Please hit dark hole. Please. Oh, damn it. Okay. That kind of sucks, but it's okay. He's probably going to summon Fortress again. No, he's not. Okay, that's fine. Thank you. So, yeah, I'm actually looking pretty good. I can just go Omega. No! Oh, okay, that kind of sucks. Um, I'm seven. I don't. I mean, he might have drew into that, so uh, hopefully it's not anything too scary. Limiter removal, that sucks. So that looks like I'm in a bit, bit of a pickle for next turn, but uh, okay, whatever. That's fine. Whatever. Go for it. Okay, gear frame, add fortress, I guess. Oh, cannon, so he's running two cannon, two fortress by the looks of things. So, ditch the fortress and. What? The fortress and the cannon? Really? Why would you do that? Oh, whatever. Whatever. 
he's probably going to equip the gear frame to at the end of the turn, so Dark Core would be pretty much useless. Okay, whatever. I'll take the damage. Yeah. So, uh, Dark Coal is pretty much useless at the moment. So, by the looks, of things I'll be I'm in for quite a bit of damage. So, I'll just set the bottomless end right there. If you MST's, he's, he's, you know. One for one. Okay. Oh, more damage. Great. Alright, whatever. Okay. <sighs> Oh, come on, I don't want to lose this last duel for you guys. Come on, I've got to win this. Okay, set the XE reborn. Um, dark hole. Do you know what? I don't care, I'm, I'm just going to do it. I'm gonna bring back the tell me actually. So that way I can add back the sombre and go for have this on the field and a play these. No! Oh no, that was a bad idea. Oh why oh, that was a massive misplay on my own part there. Ah, uh, okay, whatever. So yeah, by the looks things this is gonna be game. Uh, I might have one more duel. What what's the time looking like? Twenty seven minutes. Okay. Yellow gadget. Okay, so this is gonna be a good game here. Yeah. Yep. Right, so that's it, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. Uh, I managed to win the first two duels, but uh, as you can see, you can tell it's just just. <laughs> Not fast enough, they're really not. Uh, but yeah, thanks a lot for watching. You know, thanks a lot for 50 subscribers. Once again, you know, it'd be awesome to get to 150 by the end of the year. And hit like, subscribe, comment, and see you guys later.